What's up guys, Sal here. So there are a lot of back and forth rumors on the upcoming iPhone SE 2. Earlier, it was believed that it's gonna look exactly like the existing iPhone SE with some upgraded internals and glass back. However, a new leak intensifies the rumor mill that it will look exactly like the iPhone 10 from the front, albeit in a smaller form factor. This is coming from a well-established case and accessory maker, Olixar. In fact, they're so confident in this design Design that they're already taking pre-orders for those screen protectors. But I don't think the rumors are true and here are some reasons why. For one thing, the notch isn't just a design aesthetic on the iPhone. It actually houses the TrueDepth camera system and I don't believe Apple have shrunken it down to an SE friendly size in less than a year. Second, Apple would never release an iPhone with a notch and also a chin bezel on the bottom of the display the way every Android phone maker is doing. That's just not gonna happen. The iPhone 10 uses flexible OLED display and the reason it doesn't have a chin is that the screen falls inwards at the bottom. I'm sure Apple won't use flexible OLED on the SE2 because the iPhone SE is Apple's least expensive iPhone. Adding a flexible screen and the true depth camera system will add more to the cost of the device and that would defeat the point of its existence as a budget friendly alternative to the larger iPhones. Not to mention potentially cannibalize sales for this year's iPhones too. So that being said, I have no inside knowledge on what Apple's really going to announce. Maybe I'm completely off base but I've been doing this for many years now and the notch on the SE2 seems too bogus to be true. I have no doubt that one day all iPhones will have a notch but not so soon on the iPhone SE. Anyways, let me know your thoughts on this and I'll see you all tomorrow. Peace out. Okay.